Hello, my name is Ryan Carey from Project Enlist Canada, and we want your brain. I am the Director of Military Engagement for um, the Concussion Legacy Foundation, which uh, Project Enlist falls underneath, um, underneath that banner. Uh, I first became aware of the Concussion Legacy Foundation, which started in the States, after football players that I had uh, grown up following and watching on, on TV, um, uh, you know, were in the news, uh, either for suicide or, or uh, um, for mental health issues um, and or early onset uh, Alzheimer's, Parkinson's, um, you know, age-related uh, uh, brain disorders. And um, I, I was fortunate enough to play in the Canadian Football League before joining the Canadian Armed Forces. And it was through a mutual coach uh, and friend that I met uh, Tim Fleiser, who's the director of the Concussion Legacy Foundation Canada. Tim played uh, in the CFL as well. Um, and we met, uh, geez, almost two years ago to start discussing um, the issues related to head impacts in the military and mental health. And... Um, it was to, I don't think any of our surprises that, that um, with relation to mental health, that head injury wasn't on anyone's radar screen. Nobody was asking the questions. Um, I don't know how many uh, professionals are aware of the amount of head impacts that Canadian Armed Forces uh, members, uh, current serving and veterans, uh, receive uh, during their, their careers. Um, it doesn't mean that it's 100% a factor. Uh, as we know, trauma uh, and mental health challenges are, are multi-factored, but it's certainly something that needs to be look, looked into and addressed because oftentimes treatments for trauma and for head trauma um, can be very different. Uh, and, and at least it helps your medical professional maybe understand um, potentially why certain uh, treatments aren't working uh, or to help in, in, in figuring out the direction uh, of your treatment. Uh, so it's definitely um, uh, the aim of Project Enlist Canada is to accelerate the research on uh, traumatic brain injury, on uh, chronic traumatic encephalopathy and PTSD, uh, post-traumatic stress disorder amongst Canadian Armed Forces veterans. Um, our goal is to, um, to raise awareness for the program by receiving uh, a thousand brain pledges by October of this year. The pledges are really you just saying as a Canadian Armed Forces veteran that, yeah, this is research that needs to be done. Uh, we, we need to start looking into this. And, you know, we, we're applying for government grants because you need grant money in order for research to take place. It, it's, it takes money. Um, and so your support, your pledge for this uh, means that you, you uh, understand and support that. Now, having said that, I know brain donation, um, it's a bit awkward and some people may, may find it, um, you know, there's religious uh, um, considerations. Um, and what, what I'll say to that is that there, just because you sign up for the project doesn't mean that your brain will 100% be autopsied upon your death. It's still up to your family. It's still up to you and your will. Um, it really is just showing support for uh, the program. There, there's there's also many factors when it comes to research um, uh, to, to, to pick subjects for research. And, uh, you know, one of the things we're going through is the logistics and the, and, and the, 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 the kind of research that's going to go into this, it's a lot more complicated than you think. <laughs> a lot more complicated. Um, so it takes time and it takes a lot of energy. Um, but it's the reason why I, I pledged my brain. My kids make fun of me. Um, they say that I'm not really using it, so I could probably give it up right now. Um, but I think I have a few more years uh, left to use it. Um, and so that's why I'm behind this project uh, 100% and we could use your support. If you are interested in pledging your brain to support the project, 
uh, you can go to uh, projectenlist.ca. There's a pop up there, and uh, you can, you can pledge your brain uh, in support of the project. And uh, if you have already uh, pledged your brain, really really appreciate that support. And uh, looking forward to uh, seeing you uh, back here on this channel um, for uh, for updates and uh, things to come. Thank you. Thank you.